G'day guys and welcome to Primal Waters. Today we're going to have a look at a image that was shared to me a few weeks ago by one one of my uh, work colleagues. And when I saw this image, I couldn't believe it. Just after talking about the uh, the 13 foot great white shark here in South Australia that was found bitten in half, we got this image that uh, turned up. Uh, I'd like to give a big uh, shout out and thank you for Trapman Birmingham. Uh, for allowing me to use that image in my video today. Make sure you go over to their Facebook page and like their page and also go subscribe to them on their YouTube channel. They've got a lot of fishing and shark videos. Uh, I will provide the link uh, for these in the description bar down below. So go over and uh, check them out and say that Primal Water sent you as well. But uh, this image just coming after the, uh, uh, the news about the great white shark is uh, pretty scary to think that uh, something bigger is out there um, making a meal out of uh, Australian big sharks at the moment. Now, apparently, the story here is that um, they were out shark fishing. They had hooked a smaller tiger shark. Now, this mako came along and uh, made the meal out of the uh, tiger shark, got uh, hooked. And as they were ruling this uh, shark in, something bigger came along and uh, pretty much bit the shark in half. You can actually see that there's one massive bite with one little more uh, bite just above it. Uh, so they didn't see what this, what type of shark it was, what did it, um, but uh, going by the picture here, it would have been a fairly large one, more or, more or likely a, a great white shark. They freq frequent these waters uh, in New South Wales, um, but uh, pretty scary. And um, like I've said in my uh, v videos on my YouTube channel, uh, there's stories that go back nearly 100 years, especially in New South Wales, about uh, sightings of uh, pretty big great white sharks in those waters and that. So it just goes to show um, there's always a bigger fish out there. And always, uh, it's interesting, uh, like I mentioned, the stories that we're starting to find about uh, large sharks being uh, preyed upon by even larger sharks um, go back to Shark Alpha in Western Australia. Uh, the story uh, I did only a few weeks ago about uh, the great white shark that was found by a abalone diver off of Flinders Island, uh, which uh, was missing the back half of the shark. And then there's also the story I did uh, a few months back. I think it's uh, in the top part of New South Wales or Queensland where a, uh, a I think it was a 10-foot great white shark that was uh, hooked. Uh, fisheries guys went out there to... Uh, uh, to check the uh, drum line, uh, came across the Great White, which had massive bite marks taken out of it. So it just goes to show, yes, there are bigger sharks out there, and, uh, yeah, pretty scary. Uh, awesome picture. Like I said, thank you for Trapman Birmingham. Uh Make sure you go check their Facebook page out and their YouTube channel as well, and uh, there you go. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Video. Thank you for uh, tuning in. Make sure you drop a comment down below. Hit that like button. Share this video. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next video.